I have some bismuth crystal, but I can't say that I've ever used it in a healing session. I have used it for meditation. I think that it's really cool because, for those of you that don't know, so bismuth is a natural element that normally when it's found on earth, it's sort of gray and lumpy and a little bit shiny. But what they do now is they harvest that bismuth that you find in sort of the raw form in the earth. And most of the time they do this in Germany. And in fact, I've never seen a piece that didn't come from Germany. But they melt down that bismuth and they give it enough time and space to cool and crystallize. Because in the earth, it's always been found in its massive form, which means it's it's cryptocrystalline. So there are crystals, but you can't see them with your naked eye. It just looks like a big lump. Um, kind of like rose quartz most of the time. It's just in a big chunk. But they they when they melt it down in these labs and they give it enough space to cool, it actually forms these little, like, they almost look like Mayan pyramids. I mean, they're amazing. These little stair-step pyramid crystals, and they are so cool. And that's how bismuth would be found in nature if it had ever been found in a place where it had a lot of space to cool and crystallize. But we just haven't found it naturally that way yet, to the best of my knowledge. Maybe somebody has somewhere, and it's just so rare that it's super expensive, and I've never even seen anything like that. That's possible, but to the best of my knowledge, it hasn't been found that way. It's just been found kind of grain lumpy. And then they take those little stair step pieces, and those would normally be just sort of silvery looking, but sometimes they oxidize them. Um, so that the surface looks like it's coated in sort of rainbows, which is really pretty. But I think they're great for meditation because that little stair-step structure is all about just going upward and ascending and connecting with your spiritual self. Um, so I think they're really great for that. If anyone has a little piece of bismuth and you want to try meditating with it, I think that's a good idea. Pretty cool. It looks E.T., like it got dropped off here. Totally. And that's totally that, like, Mayan connection. A lot of people think there's, like, a Mayan E.T. connection and all that. It's just, like, that ascending up into the heavens kind of structure that I think has that E.T. connection for bismuth. So, so you can just hold it in your hands while you meditate. Or if you have a small enough piece and you want to just lay down and make yourself comfortable and try putting it on your third eye and just really using that to ascend, um, to go up into the higher planes of existence, connect with your higher self. I think that's kind of a neat thing. So check it out.